a record number of new cases for the fourth day in a row. And Illinois topped 15,000 cases for the first time. There were 27 deaths, and more than 5,300 people have been hospitalized. The positivity rate is now 13.2%. All but six counties are now at a warning, warning level. And Governor Pritzker is calling the exploding number of cases a crisis. And WGN's Kelly Davis is joining us now with more on that. Kelly. Good evening, Ray and Micah. Illinois is on the verge of another statewide shutdown as the number of COVID-19 cases continues to climb. The biggest concern we're hearing from health officials is the hospitalization rate. Yeah, they're awful. They're awful. I, I, they're, this is this is we are at a crisis level. I've said that for some time. Friday marks the fourth straight day of record high numbers. The state's COVID-19 cases top 15,000 for the first time ever. Since passing that 5,000 mark, we've been increasing every day, and these are all-time highs, breaking any numbers that we saw in wave one. Hospitalization rates continue to be the biggest concern. Over the past three days, there have been more COVID-19 patients in the hospital each day than at any time during the spring. As of last night, more than 5,000 people were battling COVID-19 in the hospital. Of those, 990 patients were in the ICU, and nearly 500 were on ventilators. More Illinoisans are in the hospital battling COVID-19 now than we saw at our highest average in the spring. And increasingly, we have regions at risk for potential ICU bed shortages and staffing shortages. The state has seen projections that are worse than what we saw in the spring, although we are better prepared with stockpiles of PPE, better testing, and plans if hospitals reach capacity. Our hospitals are not overrun. Um, but we have hospitalizations that are rising at a rapid rate, and we want to make sure that we don't get to a point where patients are getting turned away. Health officials say the only way to get back some sense of normalcy is by reversing this trend, and the power is in our hands. Everybody's saying, what are we going to do? What are you going to do? Individuals need to take the responsibility to control this virus. And I'm really wanting people to step up and stop looking for somebody else to do the job that we individually have the power to do. Governor Pritzker continues to warn the state could be headed for another mandated stay at home order in the coming weeks if we don't get the current surge under control, but it's still unclear exactly when or how he's going to make that call. Reporting live, I'm Kelly Davis, WGN News.